welcome back to my channel so right now i'm not even sure what we're doing but i'm gonna be posting i look like i'm bald because my hair is pulled all the way back um i'm gonna be posting or i'm gonna be doing like i guess this is like my vlog but it's kind of like a taste test um i'm going going to my family friends and we're gonna taste his lasagna so he's a good cook it's okay it's not like anything bad is gonna happen but um he's cooking lasagna right now and so i'm gonna go over there and like taste test okay so, but this is going in the lasagna yeah this is yes okay people don't know what that is so you have to say that so we have um first we saute some onions Mm -hmm. And celery, okay, um, and garlic and carrots, and then after uh, that sautéed for about twenty minutes, we add in um, the uh, veal and uh, pork sausage, Dang. and then uh, after about five minutes of that, we add some white wine, okay, and then after that, we put in um, some tomato paste, and we uh, get that cooking for about another. Two three minutes, and then we add in our um, palati, um, our uh, basically our, our sauce, homemade sauce, and then also some San Marzano too, um, mm -hmm. as well, and then uh, and some basil, and then we just let it simmer. It's been cooking now for about uh, two and a half hours. So here we have our ricotta, and we have um, three eggs in there and then oh. uh, pecorino. And then what we'll do is when this is ready, we'll take about two, two or three scoops of the sauce and we'll mix that in there and then uh -huh. we'll, we'll get going. But yeah, Dang. so this is, uh, okay. yeah. And then we come over here though, but when you're Wait. making this, we gotta have, we gotta have some papato, we got some calabrese, um, we got another one of these, but we ate that one, but the, uh, calabrese right salami. And we got a little pane, yep. And we got mm. all our pecorino in here. This is how. That's ready. Yep. And then. Wait, Lucci, come back. The, Hold on. Uh, we, we gotta come over here. Now we got all our. Wait, pecorino. you gotta help me. <laughs> you oh, yeah. This... Mozzarella. You got mortadella. Under here, we got some copa. We have some perchuchu de coto. We got mm. Casa Ladrano olives. We got some nice cocktail Jeez. onions. We got some, uh, we like this. Uh, this goes great together. The nut thins, Lynn loves this. Nut thins mm. with the uh, jalapeno. jalapeno cream cheese. Mm. Um, and then These are my favorite some, olives. Yes, Casa Ladrano's. Mm. So. Okay. And a little vino. Mm. Perfect. No. Okay, now Luigi, say something that you wanted to say earlier. That could get you on camera because you had something else going on over here. No, oh no. I don't want to say nothing. You want to say anything? Nope, I'm good. Are you hungry? Yes, I'm starving. When's the last time you ate? Um, I haven't really eaten anything. Okay, that's not good. Whenever, whenever you guys are making something, it's like an all-day thing. Oh yeah. It was never just like. No, always. <laughs> it's an all-day thing, and then yeah, that's why we have these over here yeah we're always eating we're a little cheese a little wine but that's the wine. whole point of the Sunday. whole point yeah we're all it's relaxing we're watching the bears we're doing you know just just relaxing and eating and enjoying each other's company exactly so Oh, yeah, he's there. Three eggs. Oh, our sea salt from Sicily. Mmm. Just a little bit. That's all my dad cooks with is sea salt. Yeah. He uses sea salt all the time. And then a uh, little pepper here. Come over here. A couple scoops in the pan. Are we starting to this right now? Are we layering this right yeah, now? Yeah, we're, we're layering. Oh, right oh god. This is my name. <laughs> so we go a little this. This. That was a really nice, line. yeah, that was a really nice, like, shout out. Because it's all like they're all the, you know. She's that, tripping. that world, yeah, no, yeah. you're tripping. You're tripping, Lynn. Stop. Stop. 
Why is this so embarrassed? It's just a camera. It's not like anybody's here. It's literally just us and a phone. You don't want too much. No, because then it's like soupy. No. Now we're just gonna mix it around. Mix this in. Too. Now after this video was up, my dad's gonna be like, why don't you take a video of me making something? <laughs> Going. I don't know where it's going at all. Shut up. Um, anyway, slice of ham, <laughs> ground beef. <laughs> I don't like peas, but the peas were in there. They were the best. So, one thing I like to do is I like to have five layers if I can. Five layers. <laughs> yeah, well, two of the three. And I have it on the, the thing that's going ding, 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 ding. However many layers we Yes. Doing. Five layers. What's it normally? Like, some you do just, five layers, but what do people some do? Some people, I think, like, the true layers, it should be five, I think, that I see all the Italians make. Like, and what I've had in, in Bologna and Modena, there's always like five layers. Um, most people just do three, and I, I think that's not. It's like, that's kind of no, it need, yeah, I, I think it needs to be. You really need the, the pasta in there to make it substantial. I have no idea. I'll know. <gasps> Hey, Damien! <laughs> it's just a video! Why is everybody being so weird? Because it's a video! Get out, get out of the video then. 
Go upstairs. Stop, bitch. Did you just come from work? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I came from work. Whoa! As much as Sammy doesn't oh, want to be in this video, I, he keeps I, popping I, up. Well, yeah. I, should, <laughs> I thought that was like cheese or something. Little. Cheddar cheese. I thought you were putting cheddar. I thought he was putting cheddar cheese on. Stop. No cheddar cheese. You knew it wasn't cheddar cheese. On top of the lasagna? No. You know there's no cheddar cheese in it. You know. I got a project on. My hair is awesome. He's so. <laughs> oh, Lou. Fifth layer, okay. <laughs> there's another, there's plenty of room then. Yeah, there's, yeah. Can't get scared, don't get scared. Mm -hmm. I mean, then now we'll, it goes take, in we'll the oven. go in the oven for an hour at 400. A lot of people don't cook it that long, but that's what really makes it. And then, um, then we'll take it out. We'll put the mozzarella and the yeah. pepper on there. And we'll be ready. <laughs> oh, wait, I gotta go back. Yeah, There's a little pick it up. Mm -hmm. These are onions. Are they vinegared? I mean, mm -hmm. pickled? Yeah. Those are tart. What's blue? One. That's a lot of, that's a lot. That's a lot of pasta. Yeah. No. Uh, no, oh, thank I you. Get real. I was like, no, this is good. Jeez. I want to make sure I did it right and not like blue. Oh, what? I got him this uh, gray tea jacket. Oh, dude, that is ridiculous. Yeah. Ready? I don't know. Lynn's freaking me out. I don't want to burn my mouth. No, only if you take a big bite. I, I take a big sit. bite. The inside. Mm-hmm. Why do you do that? I mean, You're like, mm, I think it's really good. I think it's really good. Consistent. The noodles are perfect. Yeah, the noodles. They're not overdone. Right. And mushy. Mm-hmm. 
Ooh. Damn, that's really good. Simple, but perfect. It's like simplistic. That's mm. how I, I like to cook. I'm not too flashy. That's so good. Mm-hmm. Damn. That's really good. So I got home and washed my face and realized I didn't even like close out the video. Um, but so that lasagna obviously was bomb AF, um, which I'm not surprised. He always does a really good job. Um, it was like perfect balance of um the the cheese, the sugo, the meat, wasn't too much meat, wasn't too much sugo. Um, the noodles were cooked perfectly because there's nothing worse than like soggy lasagna that's like mushy. But so this was like perfect. It was like, and when you look at it, it was like, I should have taken a picture. Um, but you can see in the video. It's just like stacked perfectly and it's not like falling apart and stuff. Um, so it was just like a really good balance of like the cheese and the smooth of like like the sugo and it was just it was just everything was perfect it was so good it was really good damien said it was good but it was really good so 10 out of 10 20 out of 10 whatever it was perfect so that's a review on chris cesario's lasagna if Anybody else wants me to review their food, let me know. I'll do a review. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks, everybody, for watching. My hair is falling out of its bun. Whatever's, whatever's. Uh, thanks for watching. Comments, questions, concerns, drop them down below. And that's it. Stay tuned for my next review.